Okay, I'm back with another video. This video is going to focus on the new Nike Limited Vapor Fuse. It's the New Jersey that Fanatics and NFL Shop they came out with this year. Heard a lot of mixed reviews with it. Some people say get it. Some people say don't get it. So what I'm going to do, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to compare this jersey to the game jersey. And also I'm going to compare it to uh, last year's Vapor Limited jersey. And what I'm going to try to do is show you how it's more similar to last year's Vapor Limited jersey than the game jersey. Some people saying that it's more similar to the game jersey, which I kind of disagree. So, okay. So here we got the um, Vapor Fuse jersey. It retails at $175. Of course, Fanatic and NFL Shop always has sales. 25, 30% off. You know, fan cast if you Shop on NFL shop or fanatics a lot. So you more than likely you would get it cheaper than this. Okay. So what's new about this jersey is the um the collar, the chain mail. It got little designs in it now, look a little bit different. The metallic NFL emblem is still the same. It's kind of 3D. You can look at it from the side. Okay. The stitching is a little different, as you can see. We have stitching coming along the side. Then it goes out. Okay, they... Change the jock tag. The jock tag look a whole lot different. And this is the part where, well, a lot of people don't like it's the uh, number. The number is heat press. It's applied on by heat. But the thing about that, even though it's it's heat applied, the material itself is still that twill material. Okay, what I'm going to do is we're going to go back to last year. Vapor Limited. It's the exact same material. I don't know if it's going to show up on camera or not. The only difference is this one got stitching on it. And this one don't. That's the only difference. Of course, like I said, the chain mail is different. And the jock tag is different. Last year, jock tag was kind of satin. Now, going back to the um, vapor fuse. Like I said, this is twill. The number is twill. I'm going to bring the game jersey out. And this is totally different material right here on the number. It's heat pressed too, but this is totally different material. This, after a few washes, it'll probably start fading. This is high quality. Like I said, this is the exact same material as up, that was on the Vapor Limited last year. So for people who say don't buy the Vapor Fuse, I mean, I don't understand. It's new technology. It's an upgrade. I guess people don't like change. But there's nothing wrong with this jersey. Okay. Well, going back to the fuse, we're going to look at it from the back. The name play is Heat Press. But like I said, it's, it's, it's Twill. It's not like the game jersey. Nothing like the game jersey. The material is totally different. 
This is the same material that was on last year's Vapor Limited. The game jersey, as you can see, it's, it's totally different. Perforation down the side. The stitching, similar to the front, goes down and goes to the side. Like I said, the Limited is my favorite jersey because I think it's the um, best quality jersey for the price. I think the game jersey is nice, but it don't have as much detail as the Limited jersey. And I think the Elite jersey are awesome, but it is way too expensive. I mean, wonder for the price point, I like the Elite jersey the best, of course. But um, yeah, the Limited is the way to go for me. That's the Vapor Fuse jersey. This is last year Vapor Limited. Same material. Exact same material. The chain mail is different. The twill on the numbers is the same, except it got stitching around it. The jock tag is different, as I pointed out earlier. On the commander's jersey, the stripes are heat press. This is the um, diffuse jersey. That's the exact same thing. The Nike logo and broader on both. Exact same thing. And as you know, last year run, they had the upside down Y stitching. And of course, the nameplate is stitch. So, besides the stitching, the jock tag, the stitching around the numbers, the stitching on the nameplate, and the jock tag, and the stitching on the jersey, it's the exact same jersey basically. It's way closer to last year limited than the game jersey. As you can see, the game jersey. It's a nice jersey, but you can tell it's lower quality. It's lower quality. The NFL emblem is plain, regular white. And they both do have heat press stripes, at least for the Washington Commanders anyway. The jock tag is not shiny like it is on the Limited. This is heat press, and it's a totally different material that's, that's on the um, Vapor Fuse. The Vapor Fuse is a twill. This is more like, it's feel almost like rubber, a plastic. The Nike Stripe, same thing. It's a nameplate. So don't be scared to get the Vapor Fuse because you think it's like the game jersey. It's not. It's nothing like the game jersey. It's more like last year, Vapor Limited than anything. One last jersey I'm going to throw in this video before I close out is the um, Vapor Untouchable. The Vapor Limited Untouchable. And this is um, the 2023 run of this. And is that they, they actually kind of made it similar to the fuse. It retails at the same price at one seventy five. It's like the um, vapor limited fuse. They did the number the same way, no stitching, heat press. But this this number is twill. The chain mail, it does like last year vapor elite. The NFL emblem. The same heat press stripes. They did update the jock tag. The jock tag is new for this this year.
and the stitching is pretty much the same. The upside down wire. Once again, the nameplate doesn't have any stitching, but the material is twill. It's better material that's that's on the game jersey. Royal Nike symbol. Okay, so that's about the end of this video. I mean, don't be afraid of change. Change could be a good thing. I think the Vivid Fuse jersey is actually a great jersey. And if they completely done away with Vapor Limiters and go straight to Vapor Fuse, I'll be all for it. I don't see no problem with it. So, until the next video, I'll see you later. I'm going to try to do a video on some um, Mr. and Ness jerseys. The uh, Mr. and Ness Authentic and the Mr. and Ness um, Legend jersey. I'm going to do a a video on that next but if, if you like the video it was useful for you um, give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel my channel is kind of weak <laughs> so any subscribers will be appreciated and I'll talk to you next time thanks for watching peace